Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I've been back and hunting again. Yay! And this is storage and it's in my favourite kind of storage, which is the zip up cases with the handle. So let's get into it and have a look. This one is from ooh, Crinkle Amazon and it was supposed to be 29.99 because it is packed full of goodies and it was reduced to 19.99 and i thought mm, shall i shan't i mm, it's not a bad price just for the case anyway but i thought when i saw all the goodies inside i thought mm, yep i'm gonna have to have that and give it a try so it's one of the ones as i say with the zip and the nice carry handle that's like uh, on the springs there that just pull out and flatten back down see ya just flattens in two doubles well two double zips two zips <laughs> on each side so hopefully i've opened this the right way i'm hoping that the handle's on that side uh, no it's not so it goes that way the handle's on the bottom yay where's my stickers there's my stickers from charlotte look these are very very handy and it just puts a little sticker on it to let me know that that's the lid and it's this way up. <laughs> yeah, she sent me them in a little happy mail package. <laughs> but I do use them, as you can see. And uh, that could have been disastrous if I hadn't thought, oh, I'm putting it straight, let me just get it straight. That'll drive me mad if it's not straight. Uh, yeah, it could have been disastrous if I'd have opened it up the wrong way. So, are we ready? Da 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 da! my goodness me it is packed all right so we'll take that out for now and have a look at that in a second so one two three four five six one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so we've got 60 bottles they've got a bit delved in because i think this is a little bit full at the top there but it'll some flat um it'll some sort of like spring back as uh, i take the top bit out there that extra little thing so yeah we've got 60 of your little screw top bottles these are your ones oh and they're the good ones as well so they've got the soft plastic lids these are the ones i prefer uh, the hard plastic bottle and the soft plastic lid if you get oh <laughs> it's alive if you get the hard plastic lids with the hard plastic bottles i tend to find when this you put the lid on it can squeal and it's like nails down a blackboard and i don't like the sound but anyway <laughs> maybe that's just me but these bottles hold about 14 to 1600 drills um so yeah they're uh, they're handy they're a good size and they are my go-to i tend to use my 30 more because i do tend to do smaller paintings but sometimes you have that little bit bigger painting so you've got the chance of using 60 yay so that's sort of the standard bit that you would normally get and you'd normally pay about 20 pound for a case like this sometimes you can get special offers on them but this one as i say you're more or less getting all these free and i like the extras i do like my tool kits and sealing bits and pieces and uh, what's this thing is this just a little silicon bag yeah that's just uh is it instruction? No, it's a silicone bag just to keep everything dry. I'll leave that in there for now. So, oh yeah, you've got your little neck pocket at the top there as well. It has got a little bit bored out at the top, I think, because it's been so full. But as I say, once I start using it for my diamonds, it will all uh, flatten out a little bit more. But there's no detriment to being able to use it at all. And yay, so I have another 60 storage case. I've got loads to get up at the minute. And then it came with one of these little foam trays. Uh, we've got your little stickers there. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we've got 40 stickers. Mm -hmm. and we'll have another uh, 20 somewhere because it's a 60 case. Anyway, and then, so this is like a little mat. Just wants a bit of a straightening out. It's just got a little bit squished. It's all like foam rubber the fairly dense foam so that uh, it's supposed to stay in shape and you've got uh, four lots of four so you've got 16 of your little cases there i'm not sure how many they hold probably i would think maybe 800 maybe get four bags of 200 in these three definitely 
for maybe at the push but yeah so i mean to be honest doing smashing the specials if you are wanting to just put your drills in these for your kits there's very few of them that are over 16 different gems and then this part you put your trays in it yay i have seen these before um, and i have looked at things like this and i thought well would i really use it or not but then when it's like coming in a bundle and you're more or less getting it free with just a storage case that i'm going to use anyway i thought well, i might as well give it a go so it does fit your little standard green trays which you do get in the kit there is a little bit of wiggle room so i wonder if it'll fit the little white trays may do it certainly fit the craft buddy white trays anyway i'm not sure if it'd fit your spout ones so if you're doing your um special drill paintings you maybe won't fall lots of special drills you know so that if you've missed one you can just bump back to it and do another color at the same time and you could just put your colors in these uh, just number them one to 16 and do it that way but yeah i just thought that was a handy dinky little doodah to have that i've not tried before might give it a go i'm very clumsy this is what puts me off these things i am exceptionally clumsy and i don't think if i've got four lots of drills out at once that I may spill. I do sometimes use two lots of drills and um, while I've been doing some of the special drill projects I have found that I've had ones for whatever reason that I kept missing so I kept one tray with um, some of that colour in that I kept missing and used the other tray and then just kept going backwards and forwards as I needed them and I sort of managed that without spilling them but whether I've managed four mm, not sure but I can give it a go can't I? <laughs> So let's see what else we've got in here. Oh, 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 two new trays. Oh, look at those. Uh, again, I have seen these before, but I've not had one. And these are just your lemon shaped or your leaf shaped. Is it a lemon shape? No, it's not really a lemon shape. It's a leaf shaped, isn't it? But it's a lemon colour uh, with a spout. So we've got two trays, two different sizes. So they're nice. I like the fact that they slot into one another as well uh, so you'd need a stopper but i suppose really if you're using the big tray you could use that as a lid on a night if you're wanting to leave your diamonds your gems in there hmm yeah uh, i do actually use the wax my spare wax for uh, yeah i use my spare wax as a stopper for these so all i do is get one of the little squares take the little square off the top and then fold it over in on itself so it sort of sticks to itself and then you can just squidge that into there and then you've got like a little stopper on your trays i do that with my little white trays as well and it, it stays in and it's just a, an extra use for your red wax if you don't use it on much uh, that one's a little bit wider you'd maybe need to put two pieces together yeah you'd need two pieces for the little wider spout but certainly for the smaller spout and that's like a standard size really and uh, yeah i just fold a piece of wax in half and put it in there so just a little tip that i use <laughs> so that's two boats hmm. yeah do you know i've always said that they were lemon boats but they're not other the leaves <laughs> oh dear what else have we got in here oh a big load of uh, grip seal bags um do you reckon there's maybe 50 in there definitely more than 20 we'll say 50 50 at a guess i say it didn't say how many it wasn't one of those things that said it's got a thousand items in it and that includes like the bag it comes in and all the rest of it you know you have to count every little minuscule item and every sticker uh, so it didn't do that it just said it had the extras i will put the link i'm not sure whether it's um still out of this price but as i say at the time of buying which was a couple of days ago 19.99 wow great as a starter kit for somebody as well but great for me because i just collect it all i just love it all what can i say <laughs> so yeah don't know why i'm sat playing with those let's have a look at the rest of it see if we can get these out oh let's just what have we got here all right so we've got some of the cheapy bendable 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 making my own words up now bendable metal tweezers uh yeah great for uh, doing on photograph frames as i've showed you in the past some picture frames getting those little horrible black things that you have to take off the back these are actually um shaped 
so you can pick things up but i mean they're okay i do tend to say oh no they're only the cheapy ones which you know they don't they are quite bendable things aren't bad actually these aren't bending as much as some i've seen but i do tend to like the heavier uh, more substantial tweezers but yeah great if you've not got any tweezers uh, oh, we've got a nice mermaid a drill pen. I can imagine that this one will disappear to granddaughter because she likes mermaids. In fact, both of my granddaughters, when they were on holiday, did mermaid swimming. They actually put mermaid tails on and they were shown how to swim as a mermaid in the swimming pool. So there you go. Never knew such things existed. <laughs> so that is uh, a nice drill pen there. Uh, not bad to hold, not a bad weight. Uh, there's quite a bit of thickness there to get a hold of. Um, will the grip go on it? Oh, with a bit of squishing, I'm not going to do it, but I reckon with a bit of squishing, you would get your squishy on there, but then you wouldn't be able to put your lid back on. But, uh, oh, it's actually a fish. I was thinking it was a mermaid's tail, but it's actually got a fish's face. Look, if you can see that. It's actually got like an eye there, and it's got a mouth here, and it's got its gills on the side. Didn't show up very well with the glare but yeah that's actually like a fish's head and like a mermaid tail so it's actually a fish <laughs> i'm learning a lot today okay what else have we got in here got uh, two squishies oh three squishies so these are your little pen grips and um, you just literally put them oh, <laughs> can't put it on that one <laughs> put these onto your standard pens and it just gives you that extra little bit of bulk to hold on to when you're diamond painting uh, and particularly in this weather say we are up to well in the 90s the heat again today uh, so excuse me i do have my little desk fan on and um, yeah it, it just gives you that extra little bit of grip um, and if you've got dexterity problems you've got to uh, say a bit wider little uh, pen to hang on to there as well so i've got those three mm nice colours like the hot pink you know me and hot pink so in our standard pens then and these are all the new nice thin little multi placers we have a four placer a seven placer and a ten placer yeah it does actually say on them so yeah <laughs> So it's quite a nice little set there as well. You can use your multi places on any of your other pens. Um, if you find that they are just that little bit um, too thin or they don't fit snugly, you can always just put a bit of washi tape around them to put them into some of your other bigger pens. But yeah, otherwise it's quite a nice little set. And then two straighteners as well. Uh, that one looks like, is that a seven? Well, if that's a 10, that must be about a... 13 15 maybe straightness so that one will be well, that's a nine straightness so you can straighten nine drills at once but they are handy and they're quite nice if you're trying to keep your drills in a nice straight line because if you use one of these to put in between your drills it's uh, quite good for straightening them up also as well as you start off your diamond painting as you're on like the edge of your diamond painting um, you know like at corners you can actually butt your drills up to your straightener and then you've got a nice straight line to work across with so that was coming handy got quite a nice little tool set there oh we've got three little heart um heart containers of wax they're quite sweet aren't they and it's blue wax i've not tried the blue wax i have got some but I've not tried it and how many pieces are in each so there's three ooh, three pieces in each so we've got nine little hearts of blue wax in three separate little containers so nice to share with your friends these and then you can always use your containers afterwards I think they're really sweet if you make jewellery or anything they're quite nice to put little um, charms or trinkets or something in it just uh, little extras Okay, oh, we've got a nice, oh, come on out, come on out. Right, where's the scissors? I thought I was going to get away with not having to use scissors on this, but yeah, they've got to come out. Okay, so we have a funnel. And again, 
in handy if you're not brilliant at tipping your drills back into your little bottles. So if you get your little tub there, you've got your drills in your tray. So pop your funnel into your little bottle and out of your tray and straight into there. Okay, I tend to just put um, a tumble dry sheet around these as well before I use them so it just stops static because they are like a rubber material and they can get a little bit staticky with your drills, can hang on to your drills a bit longer uh, and falls down flat. So, so uh, we've got quite a few of those, but uh, yeah, I don't use them from time to time, particularly with drills that aren't behaving themselves. And oh, we've got two of these little sticky mats, so great for if you're working on an angle, um, you can stick your trays onto these. A nice sticky mat to keep everything on. I tend to find actually that if when I do use them I put my pen on it because my pen is forever rolling off all over the place so just put your pen onto it and it stops it disappearing and rolling off the desk and you've just got yourself all set up and nice and comfy and your pen goes whee, off your desk rolls across the floor and you think now I'm gonna have to get up move everything and go and get that pen so if you use that you don't have to <laughs> or maybe again that's just me so yeah uh, very handy i've actually got one of these in the car as well i put my mobile phone on so i always like to keep an eye on it as to what messages are coming through and um, just in case i don't use it obviously while driving but it's nice to just be able to have it there i don't know it's a comfort blanket thing i think i just always have my phone with me these days so we've got two of those, a blue one and a black one. And if you find that they start getting fluff on them and they stop being sticky, just run them under the tap and let them dry naturally. And they become sticky again. Marvellous. Magic. <laughs> and oh, right, here's the rest of our stickers then. So they were just a bonus. Oh, maybe they were to go on these little ones. Yeah, maybe they were to go on those then. And then we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, yeah, six. So yeah, that's your 60 stickers. Actually, there's 70 there, isn't there? Because there's seven, yeah. There's 70, yeah, little round stickers there to go onto your bottles. And then obviously your little bag as well, which these I tend to find with larger diamond paintings. Before I do them, I put my drills in the larger bags rather than keeping them in the little bags that they come in and have these uh, all filed away with the details on them. But yeah, these are really handy to have. They're like an A A5 size, an A5 notebook size, or an A5 card size. Okay, well, I think that's quite uh, a nice little stash, to be honest. It's certainly been uh, a bargain again. I just couldn't resist. <laughs> you know me. Okay, well, that's everything shown. Uh, if you've got any comments or questions, leave them in the comments down below. So it's a, a great little set. Um, I probably would have bought the case anyway, but yeah, getting all this extra and I'll possibly have a go at using this. Uh, I might even do my whipping chat using that. You never know. Might have a go. I'm going to have to be on a firm serve. It's definitely not something you could use while you're diamond painting on your knee because it's definitely going to go. <laughs> okay well if you've enjoyed looking at these with me thumbs up as always is much appreciated and if you want to come back and see what i get up to next if you press the subscribe button down in this corner and the all notifications bell you'll be notified when any of our videos come up so you won't be seeing anything yay okay well thanks for stopping by and i do hope to see you all again soon bye for now